me and today we are juicing. Yes, we are gonna juice some pineapple, ginger, and grapefruit. We've got, you got pain, that's okay. We got the anti-inflammatories. We have ginger and pineapple. Smells amazing, the two, the combination. Who doesn't love the smell of pineapple? I love the smell of pineapple, even better the taste. It's amazing. Then we have our grapefruits, high in vitamin C here. We've got our anti-inflammatories here. Oh, why not boost the immune system while getting rid of some pain up in there? Okay? Yeah, and guess what, by the way? I'm wearing my softball shirt today. Austin Sports and Social represent what? It's because I'm part of a softball team. And I decided for my softball team I'm going to make this yummy fresh juice for them and bring it on over to the game and just be like, hey guys, I've got some yummy juice for us if we're in pain or maybe we need that extra boost. Maybe we're going to get all excited and hyper like me. Everybody asks, why do you have so much energy? And I'm just like, okay, well, if you drink nothing but fruits and vegetables and have an extremely healthy diet all day, you wouldn't feel sluggish. Maybe you'd be a little happier. Plus, happiness is a choice. Attitudes is a choice. It's like... People think they have so many problems in their life, and it's sometimes that's the case, but you can be the solution to that. It's all the mindset, people. You gotta get in the right mindset. So I got my, so I got my softball socks on, lots of fun. Yeah. No, they're silly socks. They're fun. I'm not wearing shoes, I know that. Why would I wear dirty cleats in the kitchen? Not happening. So, I've got my juicer on here. We're gonna do the hardest one, because guess what, when I cut out that pineapple, I saved that core. That's right, I did. So I'm gonna juice that guy first. Oh, let's turn it on. It's my Bramble Multi Speed Juicer. Oh yeah, she took it like a champ. Got my Bramble Variable Speed Juicer here. And you can juice it in any particular order you want. I would do the harder first, and then the softer, the citrus. I'm only going to do a little bit of ginger at a time because it's very overwhelming, very powerful. I don't want to give my teammates the drink and they'll be like, well, it's just like pure straight up ginger. And I'm just like, no, I'm not going to do that to them. So, I'm put this back on. Put in some cut up pineapple and ginger. Now I have four grapefruits here and I'm going to add in on our citrus setting. We're setting number three. Now this is going to make a tasty, tasty summer cooling, refreshing drink. Lots of grapefruit juice. I'm going to give it a nice little stir and then have a taste. Just to see if I have enough ginger. You'll know how to gauge it. It depends on if you're a ginger lover or you just want to taste the pineapple and the grapefruit more. And I kept the grapefruit and the pineapple in the fridge nice and cold so that I'd have fresh cold juice once it was juiced. Oh, amazing. Perfect kick. Glad I didn't use the extra number of ginger. Oh, wow. Mmm. Summer, fruity, refreshing. I'm in love with it. I had my hair looking like a pineapple earlier. I don't know if it still is. I'm gonna pineapple up my hair for you. See? See how this is a pineapple? It's all crazy like a pineapple just sticking out. I call this look the pineapple look. So anytime I see girls that stick their buns on top of their head like this, there's just hair flying out. I'm like, oh, that's the pineapple hairdo. It really is. This is what it looks like. So, that's that for you. Heather's pineapple hairdo look. They used to have those honeycomb hive looking things back in like the 50s and no. Let's not bring that back. I feel like, you know, 80s clothes are coming back. Let's not bring it back. Anyway, enough jibber jabber. I want to show you one more trick with this. 
Now that we have perfected our juice and it tastes amazing, we are gonna get ice cube trays. This is what I've got. And what we're gonna do is I can make ice cubes with them so that when they melt, it melts back in, as into the juice so it's not watered down. And on top of that, another trick I'm gonna show you is how we're gonna freeze them and make popsicles out of them, little sticks for children. So if they wanna have a little treat on a stick, a nice cold frozen treat, that's how it goes. Let's get this going. It's gonna be good, I gotta carefully pour it. Distribute evenly, and you're gonna pull a piece of foil. Try not to waste, let's get a guesstimate of size. Instead of doing it this way, turn it this way to fit the ice cube tray. That's perfect. This is a nice bite-sized little cold treat for yourself or for your kid. I'm gonna tell you what, I'm gonna be a fun, good mom someday if I ever have kids. I'm just saying, because they're gonna get all these fun little treats and like healthy juices and stuff and like maybe some muffins because I'm good at making muffins. And this is a fun project to do together with your kids. I'm gonna sit there and teach my kids Spanish too. I'm gonna be like, Spanish lesson, okay, smoothie time, or sign language lesson time, or let's go play in the park and climb a tree together, soccer time. So you're gonna wanna feel where the cube tray is. You can push down, you can get a look, and you can see. See, if you push down, you can see the square cubes that it makes. So that way it's easier to stick it in and you'll know it's directly in the middle. And they should normally stand straight up. And then when you come to take the foil off, that stick will be right in the middle of the cube and you can eat it very easily. Upon completion of filling as many trays as you want, one all, you're gonna stick it in the freezer and freeze it overnight, freeze it however long you can. Mine's going in the freezer till tomorrow. I'm gonna save these and bring my juice, probably juice some more for everybody and call it a day. So I hope you've enjoyed this easy, simple, quick recipe, multi-use, gonna taste so good, so fresh, help with that pain. And especially with our softball team, we're gonna be like, oh man, that was a rough game, but hey, we've got Heather's juice to get us going. So I hope you've enjoyed this recipe. Make sure you look out for my books, subscribe to my channel, help me get more users, spread the word. We're just trying to spread health and happiness here. For a community, I want as many people as I can to join this community and create a big, healthy lifestyle together. And thank you for watching.